Hey, what's going on everyone? Z-Man the Tech here. Thanks again for tuning in to Snowy Games. Uh, today I'm going to be checking out Cloudberry Kingdom. And uh, I'm going to be checking it out on the Wii U. Uh, it actually does exist on other platforms, but this is the one that I have it on. And I seem to be going through a trend of uh, Wii U games right now. So uh, I'm going to keep that thing going. And um, <laughs> hope you uh, enjoy. And uh, actually, yeah, if... If you do have a Wii U and not other platforms and want to try to grab this, you know, definitely try to do so. Not sure how long, you know, the eShop is going to remain the eShop for the Wii U side. So, <laughs> but uh, anywho, yeah, um, quickly uh, about this, it, as you can see, it, it is a ridiculous platformer <laughs> with a lot of obstacles and whatnot. And um, it's all about timing uh, from what I've learned. Um, or I could be wrong, you know, um, as far as what methods actually work the best or what everyone else has tried. Uh, for me, I do think it is definitely a bit of timing and, you know, there definitely is some skill involved, but uh, I say timing is definitely more of it. Um, but yeah, um, it's kind of, the cool thing is it's kind of a parody of a, of a lot of other, you know, uh, popular platformers as far as the story goes you know you kind of got a bit of like Mario Bros parody in there and you know that's like the main one I see for sure but uh, there's other things you know that you can kind of pick up on as you play through um, but yeah let's go ahead and uh, oh and one more thing they the w really unique thing about this is actually everything is uh, is randomly generated so it's never the same levels as you, each time you play which is pretty cool so um, now I haven't done story mode um, all the way through, if not all, if not at all. I do remember actually starting with uh, the arcade mode. Um, so that's what I'm gonna go with here. And uh, as you can see, it's actually a four, up to four players at a time, which is really crazy. I, have, I haven't done that yet. I'd like to, uh, but I gotta, you know, kinda get with the, get with the folks and see, you know, um, if they're willing to do that. Um, now you can customize your little, your little character here. Uh, so let's see. Let's see when to go. I might keep that same deal there. But uh, let's see. Go T. Oh, it's the cape. Okay, I see what's going on there. Yeah, yeah, so I'll keep that and then uh, uh give him a little furrow there. <laughs> Let's see. Okay. I guess it only remains that color, but yeah, it's fine. <laughs> Alright, so yeah, we're gonna make a little character. And uh let's see here. Yeah, we haven't got to that point yet so we'll, we'll do escalation and kind of take it on up um i think these are some things that i've actually unlocked here we're gonna go with the classic and it's cool once you get to a certain you know uh level of a number of levels you can kind of jump to that number it just gets really intense so it's it's, it's better to gradually kind of move forward um but it's cool that they gave that as an option so we're gonna go ahead and get started here. Remember the buttons here. Okay, so A is jump. All right. I'm more of a D-pad guy, so I'm gonna use that. So yeah, ba basic, uh, basic operation of it is to grab all the crystals. And watch out for those lasers. You know, the first part of it you can touch, but when it actually beams on down, it'll kill you. And you pretty much die in one hit with anything. So <laughs> definitely keep that in mind. It's it's pretty easy right now, but yeah, it's gonna pick up here in just a, a little bit. You'll see. Okay. And you do have to use physics of jumping oh, off of um, enemies, kind of getting an extra bounce by hitting the jump button right before you uh, <laughs> right before you land on them kind of deal so definitely keep that in mind Ooh. oh I still got it 
I don't still got it. <laughs> oh man, this is terrible. Let me be more patient here. Ah, oh, boy. But yeah, it's definitely one of those games that a lot of people tend to rage quit on. Um, but yeah, I just figured I'd kind of bring this game out again and, uh, you know, kind of showcase its glory. It, it really was um, a really nice experience back when it first came out um, among the uh, among the indie games. Oh, right on the spike. Oh, I was so close. And definitely has some really nice tracks too from what I remember. Really good music. Um, it actually tells you the name of them as they come up too, so it's also pretty cool. There we go. Finally got it. Perseverance, people. Be careful on these clouds because you will sink in. Um, you can still jump off. Oh, shoot. You know what? I gotta... I'm gonna off myself because... <laughs> I'm really uh, OCD about getting all these things. <laughs> did I do it again? I did it again. Uh, I need it. I need it. Now, but I do believe there is a... Ah, oh, shoot. There is a live system, so you don't want to abuse it too much. <laughs> there we go. Just run off of there. Don't jump. Yeah, I almost screwed that up. Ooh. Oh, that was close. The fact that each of these levels are randomly generated is really neat. And if you and a cool thing is if you actually like one a lot, it gives you the uh, I think I missed one, I don't know. It gives you the opportunity to actually save it for later. That way you can you could always play that level sometime whenever you want. Oh okay. <laughs> I jumped clean off that time. Oh no. Come on, man. Don't do this to me. There we go. Ooh. Oh, I didn't think I was going to make that. Okay. Oh. Doing pretty good. Level 12. <laughs> As I said that. Oh, shoot. Okay, those are the ones that drop. You gotta really be ready. I'm gonna get a running start from down here. There we go. Still got it. I'm not gonna lie, I kinda wish you could change the buttons to making BB jump. It might be possible, I just, I never tried it. So Mario Brothers pretty much just <laughs> spoiled me and paved the way for that, that control setting to be default. <laughs> I'm just used to jumping with B, I don't know why. Be careful with those ghost ones too. They will ghost on you. Ah, boy. They do what they do best. Yeah, I think we got a good running start here. You can kind of just tell when you when you've uh, timed it right because everything just flows together. You find that opening. It's you got to run with it. Oh, <laughs> you got to run with it. Oh boy. Oh man, if I would have just went to the left a little bit, I would have been okay. There we go. Oh, he ghosted right then. Wow.
Oh, man. Same spot. I honestly didn't think I was going to make that. Come on, don't ghost. Woo! All right. We got it. Oh, you know what? I probably did miss one on the last one. If they're hiding them like that. I totally forgot. They're pretty sly with hiding these little gems under clouds and whatnot. Oh, he tried to off me. Chill, bro. Boom. I'm level 19. It still hasn't gotten too crazy. It, it it definitely picks it up a notch once you get to a certain point. <laughs> and then you short jump and just fail like that. Uh, ridiculousness. Almost did it again. Alright, now we got lava. It always gets more serious when there's lava involved, I tell you. <laughs> I don't know why dude is up there like that. Makes me think I can get up there. Ugh. Yeah, I probably missed one. Really good track here. I like this one a lot. I should have knew when that fireball rope went crazy like that. Oh, you know what? I do need to go up there. Try not to waste all my lives, but. <laughs> oh, jeez. I thought I was going to go quick enough, but I was sadly mistaken. Oh, man. Ooh, that was close. I just want this gym. Please. All right. I wanted it so bad. <laughs> oh. There we go. Oh, wow. I only got one life left anyway. <laughs> but, yeah, we're just... Kind of wanted to give you just a quick run through of, uh, you know, arcade mode of uh, Cloudberry Kingdom here and um, <clears throat> showcase what you can do, what it's about. There we go. Got two lives like. <laughs> oh man, I rush there. Gotta get it. <laughs> get a grip, Peacemaker. Okay, that's the next track. I'm trying to keep an eye on uh, <laughs> the, oh, the track names as they come up. Okay, we're doing 
good. Oh, okay. Barely. Hmm. Okay. <laughs> I didn't think I'd survive that little duck there, but I did. Keep getting a life back. Um, yeah. After this board, we will uh, we'll call call it a uh, video there for this gameplay. All right. But as you can see, yeah, it's pretty addictive, um, <laughs> especially once you get good at it. Um, but yeah, definitely uh, look for that on other platforms. It's been out for quite some time, so uh, just one of those games I kind of wanted to help bring back out to the spotlight. You know, really, really unique in its own right within the genre. And um, the fact that it actually allows up to four players at a time is for this kind of a game is really cool. Um, I, I can imagine it getting very frantic. Uh, <laughs> trying to get through the level with four people, uh, when it, especially when the uh, obstacles get really crazy. But uh, anywho, yeah, like, comment, subscribe if you haven't already. Um, Cloudberry Kingdom, look for it, multiple platforms. I'll have links in the description uh, for what platforms it, it is uh, actually compatible with or supported on. And uh, thanks again.